welcome to an extended video of the Samsung Galaxy S6. In this case, it will be about the S6 Edge that in yesterday's video was not booting up. So um, Armash uh, on XDA, that is uh, one of my friends, he uh, sent me um, another boot image and I implemented that boot image into the ROM. Okay, and I'm gonna show you in this video how you can fix the ROM yourself. Armash sent me a boot image and that boot image must be put into the ROM. How to do a thing like that? Well, you need 7-SIP. 7-SIP is an unpacking, repacking tool um, that beats all the others. So you don't need no other unpacking tool. Please don't do it with WinRAR. Don't do it with uh, Windows SIP because in fact these applications are kind of... Maybe, maybe it should as well work. I think, I think that it should be able to do. But try to be on the safe side and use 7-zip. Open the ROM, just click it open. You're gonna see a bunch of files and you're gonna see a little download of a zip file, a boot image that you can download. It's a very small file. After downloading the boot image, you're gonna open it. It's a zip file. Click it open and unpack that 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 boot image that you're gonna find in that in that in that packed folder and copy it to the ROM folder, just to the main ROM folder. After you copy that, the ROM is done and fixed. You can then install it, as you're gonna see. This morning, Armash sent me a file. It's a boot image that is zipped and uh, it will fix the ROM. So how can you fix the ROM yourself? Download the ROM for the G925F from the GitHub open the folder the zip folder and grab that image and copy it straight to the root of the rom file uh, you will need seven zip to do that so just open these two zips uh, the one of the rom and the one of the boot image and copy the one from the boot image into the rom itself it will override that boot image in the rom and then in fact uh, you fix the ROM, then the ROM is done uh, and then it can be installed. So uh, I'm going to copy it really fast to the internal uh, of the phone and then we're going to flash it and then it should boot. Okay, so all credits for this fix goes to Armash and he's as well the one that worked on the, uh, how you see that, on the fingerprint. Because uh, fingerprint is as well working in this room as you're gonna see. So let's go ahead and install it. Let's do a little wipe. Huh? Wipe. Dalvik system cache data. Let's do a clean, clean install. And then back. And then here. Linux OS. Alright, so we're gonna flash 06. And there we go. Flashing 06.
the build that was not booting for uh, yeah the Edge. This is the Edge uh, model, the G925F, and no other phone. Okay, G925F. Look what it's saying there. It's for this phone. It's not for the age, not for the I, not for the set, not for the I don't know what. It's for only the 925F. Okay, my good friends. And uh, yeah, yeah, of course, Armash wants me to show that fingerprint is working. Mm? Or not Armash? <laughs> Let's put the one, two, three, four again. Next, one, two, three, quarter. And then, done. More, more, more. Okay, you must just. Oh, look at how nice it works, man. Oh, look at that. Let me use this finger as well. And this one when I'm lazy. And this one. So it knows all my fingers, you know? So I don't need a special finger to unlock it. Finger one, there you go, peeps. And yesterday I was showing something stupid, but if, if the phone is locked, you just press and to unlock. You just do it one more time. Just keep your finger on the, you don't have to put password. I was showing that you must put password again. I'm just noob. I don't use these things, never, ever. Passwords and things like that. I don't like passwords and I don't like fingerprints, but it works. Okay, you see, it works thanks to Armash. Big up to Armash for that. So the camera. Yeah, the camera, same thing. Yeah, in fact, I don't have to show the whole story. I said I showed it already. But yeah, just for the edge users. So you can see it, it works, okay? It works fantastic. <laughs> all right, that all works. Did we make a video? Let's make a video. Selfie cam. There it is. I said a hip hop, clap op je kop. We rijden op de straat, auto over de kop. We rijden op de straat, auto over de kop. De hip hop, clap op je kop. We rijden op de straat, auto over de kop. Yeah, this is nice, peeps. So yeah, that works. Yeah, I don't have to make this video any longer, right? So yeah, it works, it works, man. I'm very happy. So you can still enjoy a working build. So that is all that's to it. I'm very happy to see that uh, my S6 is now as well fixed. Uh, it works just as good as, uh, as the G920, so I'm happy. So uh, repair the ROM yourself, uh, G925 users, and you will as well feel like a champ today, just like me, because I'm feeling really nice. And I want to say thank you to Armash for sending me the boot image. Thank you, Fake Manon, once again. That's it. I wish you a beautiful afternoon. I still have some, uh, yeah, some other work here to finish, and then I will show it to you. These are the G-Droid. Uh, ROMs for several of my devices as well older devices especially the old devices that have no development anymore so that and more in the next video I want to thank you once again for watching please leave some likes for this video as well uh, if you enjoyed watching it and of course if you love this project leave lots of likes at the XDA site that will be linked in the description. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video again. Until then, bye bye.